Well, she is the unforgettable 90s actress that made this phrase famous. Whatever. If she doesn't do the assignment, I can't do mine. Mm -hmm. Whatever. Now, Lisa Donovan is working on new <laughs> projects, including a brand new memoir. Yes, yeah, she is joining us now to tell us more about her new book. Good morning to you, Lisa. Good morning. Thanks for having me. I mean, stunning. You look amazing. I'll come on your show anytime. There you go. There you go. We're a little bit crazy out here. It's t it is Tangent Tuesday here. It's true. But you're you were in Clueless, Sabrina, Teenage Witch, Beverly Hills, Dental 210, all that, and now some other things in your real life have happened to you to lead you to this point. Can you share with us? So this book is about a period of time where my dad was diagnosed with cancer. The relationship I was in ended with the person I thought I was going to marry and my TV show was canceled. So I went from thinking that I understood exactly where my life was and where it was going and everything that gave me a sense of prosperity and joy was completely stripped away. And I went through this transformational time that um, I, it just changed my whole life. So this is about how, how we can go through grief and challenge and great difficulties and come out the other side with a, a greater sense of, of humanity and joy and um, yeah. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> the book is called uh, Wake Me When You Leave, released today. I mean, you've been very transparent about the things that have happened in your life in this book, yeah. also talking about um, eating disorders, just um, just very open. And I think that's amazing for young people. Is it helpful for you as you are coming out of the other side to be able to, to get it all out? Absolutely. And I, I really feel like one of my great hopes for this book is that it allows people to feel more comfortable with our discomforts. Yeah. You know, we culturally don't like to to go through difficult things and we certainly don't like to talk about them. And I think that, you know, we we're doing ourselves a great disservice by by ignoring those things when, you know, we all go through these things. It's a part of life. And I actually think that these things can enhance our lives if we can share them and walk through them literally. And um, I feel like, you know, my life is so much fuller today. And I think as a creative person, I've, I've always been somebody who feels compelled to, to share the authenticity of what's going on in life. And this is certainly a, um, a big manifestation of that. If you, if a young person is watching right now, it's not one thing you could tell them just to make their day right now. Oh, I would say no matter what, don't ever compromise who you are. You will always be the best version of you than anyone else could ever hope to be. So I think that especially now with all this social media and all these yeah. comparisons oh, and, yeah. uh, you know, it's incredibly challenging to be a young person. And I, I truly believe that we all as individuals have very specific and unique gifts and that's what the world needs. So don't try to be anybody else but yourself. Coming from you, that holds a lot of weight. Elisa Donovan, <laughs> thank you so much for your time this morning. Wake Me When You Leave, released today. So excited uh, for yes. this project and just excited to see what you're doing uh, in, in your future. You're amazing. Thank you so much, ladies. This was a pleasure. Absolutely. Have a great right. day. And, thank and just you. Just say you have great teeth. All right. You <laughs> <do. There> you <laughs> My mom will love hearing that. There you go. There I you love go. it. Elisa Donovan <laughs> live on Good Day. Stick around. More Good Day coming up after the break. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thanks.